Hey guys, it's me, your girl Katie, and we are here today to unbox another Owl Crate. This is August's box, um, and I am so tired that, sorry, I'm trying to get my cat to look, that <laughs> I don't even remember what this month's theme was. It's been a busy August. Busy, busy, busy. So let's uh, get this box open and get this started, huh? Oh, gosh. Okay. Ooh, I think it's packed chock full of stuff. All right. So, let's see, this month's theme is Written in the Stars. That's right. Okay. It is chock full of little wormies, which my cats love, obviously. I think a lot of cats love them. Let me just, real quick. Oh, sorry, guys. Sorry about the quality of the video, you know, struggle bus. Oh, okay. All right, so let's move these little wormies to the side here. The first thing in here is this cute little purple box. Hmm. It says, I think this is, who says organization, organization can't be Practical and cute. This star-shaped bottle from Team Owl Crate holds push pins for all your corkboard needs. Fun idea. Once empty, place tiny fairy lights inside this jar for some desk-side stargazing decor. Huh. Now, oh, I almost, that was almost real bad. Um... Obviously, I already looked at spoilers, and I kept seeing these, and I was like, is that just a jar full of marbles? But no, it's a pin. That's a push pin. That's so cool. I love that idea. I could always use more push pins, and this box is super cute. I love Owl Crate's boxes. They're always the cutest. Ugh. It's this cute, like, little light purple color. Okay, the next thing I see in here is this package. Uh, ooh. Team Owl Crate wants to bring some subtle starry vibes to your writing with this metal pin. Cute. And it just twists to come out like that. Again, pens are something we can always use. So that's nice. I love getting new pens. All right, the next thing I see in here. Is a bandana. Inspired by Strange the G. Strange the Dreamer. Still have not read that one. It is on my list. I promise. It's just been busy. I just, you know, busy, busy, busy. Whew. Okay, so it's this cute little bandana by Fern and Ink. They poured all of the magic they found in the night sky into the Strange the Dreamer inspired bandana. This lovely versatile piece can be used as a hair accessory tied to make the a fabric necklace or bracelet in a, and in a variety of other ways. Um, you know, I don't think I could get it tied as pretty if I opened it. Mm, I'll just, I'll just open it. Okay. It says, oh gosh. 
It says the dream chooses the dreamer. Cute. And it's super soft. I love this fabric. Okay. Um, so I will try to fold that later. Just put it back here for now. Okay, the next thing we got in here is a clipboard designed by Daphna Sabane. Daphna Sabane, I, I think. Um, it's inspired by Aurora, Aurora. Oh, gosh. Sorry, guys. It's been a real long day. Aurora Rising. And it's to add a bit of celestial magic to our workspace. You shine brighter than any constellation in the sky. That is a cute design, too. And then on the back, it just says Owl Crate. Okay. And then we have a book sleeve. This one. We are all stardust and stories. And it's simply over the moon in love with the Starless Sea inspired artwork. Corky Cup Collective created for us to feature on this book sleeve. All right, so Strange the Dreamer, the Starless Sea, Aurora Rising. Yeah, I haven't read any of these. They're on my list, I promise. I just, you know, the struggles of an ever-growing TBR. Okay. And next we have the book. The Star, or just Star Daughter. This is a really cool book cover. Star Daughter. And then, of course, the letter from the author. Okay, I'm just going to put that in there. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see this. Look at those sprayed edges. It's a dark purple. Oh my gosh, I love these. Okay, Hindu mythology provides a breathtaking landscape for this radiant contemporary fantasy tale. Inside Star Daughter, reader, readers follow... Chital, I think is how you pronounce the name, Ch Chital, uh, her quest to take, that takes her to the celestial court of shining wonders and dark shadows. Brimming with intrigue, this sparkling YA debut is perfect for fans of Roshani Chokshis and Lainey Taylor. Our signed edition features an exclusive cover and gorgeous sprayed edges. You'll also find a letter from the author, Shavetta Thakrar. That Thakrar? I hope I pronounced that right. I'm so sorry. And then, when creating this month's enamel pin, hold on, let me get it out of the package for you. Uh, designer Band of Weirdos drew inspiration from the lotus flower used to reach the stars in Star Daughter. So it's uh, kind of like bluish purple sparkles on the bottom and then like um, a dark purple matte in the middle and then uh, light purple sparkles on the top petals. It's so cute. Bonus element, the moon nestled in the flower's petals glow in the dark. Oh yeah, there is a moon in there right there and it glows in the dark apparently wow i do have a pin that already glows in the dark that i got from owl crate so that's fun all right we are almost done with this video guys okay just gotta get out our sneak peek for next month Okay, next month is A Glorious Haunting, and we will be 
uh, getting a blanket designed by Michelle Gray. So I think this is the one of the previous blankets that Michelle Gray has made for Owl Crate. I actually have that one. I do, I do. So that's super exciting that we're going to be getting another blanket by Michelle Gray. I'm sure it's going to be amazing. All right, well, that's all I have for you today, guys. I will see you in the next video. Bye.